Was the ship and the crew of the squirrely raft lost forever in a sim crossing gone wrong? Tiny Mysteries with your host, Leopard Nimoy. The Tiny Mysteries team searches for answers or just really good stories to the unexplained. Strange occurrences, unexplained phenomena, strange creatures. Sim crossings, normally a matter of mild inconvenience, turns into a harrowing encounter when a tiny cargo ship crew encounter the morning Shire Sim Crossing. Tonight we take our crack team of tiny investigators to reveal the truth or behind this alleged phenomena. It is believed that on the afternoon of April the 15th, James Fiddlepaws, captain of the skyship Squirrely Wrath, encountered with his, along with his crew the dreaded morning Shire Sim Crossing. The ship, the captain, and crew has never been heard from or seen again. Damn it, Jim, you know I hate Sim Crossings. Brace yourself. Looks like a bad one, Mr. Scott. Hey, Captain, she's not holding together. I, I, it cannot take the stress. Bones, what do we do? Damn it, Jim, I'm not a navigator, I'm a doctor. What are Sims Crossings? We asked Dr. Crimson Red London. Well, uh, yes, uh, Sim Crossings, uh, they, they are a complex element that involves the coordinated transfer of user data from one Sim server to another. Uh, let me illustrate. In this uh, simple diagram, we see that. Boring. Let's go to another location suit. Across the Morningshire Sim Crossings is the Heron Shire Wharf, and an eyewitness, Rocky Placebo, who claims to have seen the fateful crossing. Uh, yep, twas about mm, <coughs> 2.35 p.m. Uh, SLT sunset. Fish were biting good for me, but Nickers over there was sure hauling them in. Got one of them shift angle fish. They always wanted to get one of them. <laughs> well, what about the ship? Oh, yeah. I, I saw it with my own beady eyes, I did. Go and find us how you do, till that cross, and then all heck broke loose, tiny zipping all over the place, the ship underground, then zipping all over morning. I couldn't find, right, find anything. Tell what happened after that. You mean it disappeared? No, I got that fish, and also that LOL catfish. Uh, whoa, whoo, sure beat the knickers out of all them bums here. Because that's how I roll. A very compelling eyewitness report. To get a better understanding of the ship, its crew, we go to the head of the shipping line. Mr. I am a bad guy. Uh, Mr. A bad guy. Some say the squirrely wrath was carrying illegal and potentially hazardous unconfigurated sim teleporters. Is this true? I have no idea what you are talking about. Why, we were just a tiny line. Shipping waffle mix to the poor outlying shires. There's nothing to see here. Capisce? Well, and the crew, I hear their backgrounds were <coughs> unquestionable. Yes, I, I like giving the disadvantage and even break. Uh, yeah, uh, some of them have a rough history, but they know better than to crush me. We brought with us Lilith Fittipaws, the captain's wife, a Miss Fid. Hey, you, get out of my way. Frickin' tell me where he is or I'll have two fresh cat's feet for my car. That jerk has a lot of work to do and he ain't getting out of it. Far overhead in the Raglan Galaxy Space Station, we ask residents there to scan the region and report back their findings. This unit reports ground scan of morning Shire's anomaly data inconclusive. Was the Skirly Wrath transported to another dimension? What happened to her crew? Are Sim crossings more than just an inconvenience? Hey you, where's my husband? 